All right, today we're going through a brutal biceps workout because anybody can make themselves sick on a leg day, but it takes a true ass to throw up during biceps. Also, I'll throw sets and reps at the end of the video so you too can build massive. One thing I can't emphasize enough, the number of sets and exercises you're doing isn't gonna cut it. You're gonna need to double it at least. And I know that sounds crazy because it is, but if you've been at this for a long time and your arms still suck, you need to do something extreme. Otherwise, they're never gonna grow. Also, highly underrated. Most people will see me attach this rope to the cable and think, oh, he's doing cable rope curls. I've done those before. We are the same. That is neat. But what's different is I'm gonna take this rope and do seven variations of this damn thing, doing two, sometimes three sets of each. So at the minimum, I'm starting my biceps day with 14 sets. And that's nothing. That just puts a little blood in the balls. I believe the politically correct term is plums. First one being a traditional rope curl. Shoulders back, elbows wherever they naturally fall, focusing on rotating those wrists as I contract up. But then I'll do ones where I lean forward, turn it into a drag, drag on an angle, elbows back, palms up, tuck my elbows into my stomach, hammer curl style because my forearms are that of a small child. And then I'll just sit there and rotate to make sure that long head and short head have nothing left. Now, before you say this is gonna take forever, we're not measuring rest in terms of minutes or even seconds, we're counting breaths. You can adjust your bat wings and get your rest as you walk to the next exercise. The good thing about that is on our next exercise, hammer curls, most people have that internal struggle of I know I should do four sets to get the most growth, but I'm feeling lazy, so fuck it, I'll do three. You don't have to worry about it because in that time period, you've already done six sets. gotta make some dumb faces. My poor wife. Yeah, I'm still married. Just because I've had a few scandalous women in some videos doesn't mean I got a divorce. Let me give you some advice to live by. Find yourself a woman that doesn't mind if you blow creatine up another woman's ass and you'll never work a day in your life. One immensely important detail that you don't wanna screw up is the order of the exercises. And when you do this, it's crucial you start with the one with the most mechanical disadvantage and work your way to the least. So hardest to easiest. Otherwise you're gonna be screwing around with the weight or unable to move. Starting out with a reverse grip, then close, then wide, then drags, and you're picking a weight you can get 20 reps with, but by the third set of each exercise, you'll be lucky if you get six floppy dick reps. Programs are linked below. I think my balls are swollen. I don't know if that's a good thing. New assholes, click here. If you're a returning asshole, watch that video.